It's time! This game is unaffiliated with Toby Fox. Oh yeah? I doubt that. Now you best not be lying to me, Delta Traveler. I know Toby Fox made your fucking game. You schmucks got no talent. I'm just messing with you. <laughs> Don't know why I'm really trying to die on this hill. Content warning. One specific path of this game contains graphic content depicting <gasps> no pixelated blood. <gasps> you guys have seen my genocide content before. You guys have seen blood. You guys have seen murder. I think you're gonna be okay. And if you haven't, go back and watch them. But come desensitized. Come back here. And then maybe you'll be ready for my videos. pussy -o. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I'm throwing way too much shade. <laughs> Let's get on with the game. You've been warned. Don't need to be warned. <gasps> Chris and Susie go to places they shouldn't be. Hey, what is up, fam of cheese? Welcome to Delta Traveler. That's right, this is the content that you guys have been asking for down in the comments below. Now, if you guys want to hit me up with some other games that you want me to play, leave them down in the comments below. Sorry, I know I haven't been exactly super active lately. I've been a little busy. Your boy's been doing some teaching and shit like that, you know? I have a lot of important shit to get up to. But, I'm still here for you guys, posting content as and when I can, on the regs, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and the short tour week round. You know how we're moving. And I saw this one, I know you guys have been asking for this for quite a while now, a good few weeks. Uh, so here we are, Delta Traveler. This game is going to be really, really exciting for us. Uh, this is probably going to be the series that will replace Undertale Yellow. Uh, I'll start it on the Monday sessions and then it'll probably shift over to Wednesday sessions. Uh, but for right now, it's going to be an exciting little romp. So what I know about this game, all I know about this game, uh, is that this game is, uh, it says on the screen. Chris and Susie go to places that they shouldn't be at. It seems that Chris and Susie end up in the Undertale world. Somehow. And maybe other characters. Maybe we could see my boy Birdly. And maybe Noel and Rolse And who else do we really like from this game? Rules card. I like Spamton. Other characters that exist. <laughs> I'm sure there are plenty of other quirky characters in this game. Anyway, they don't matter right now. We're gonna make a brand new save file. I think I'm gonna end up going for like a pacifist run to begin with. Your own name. <laughs> Easy freaking peasy. I don't know what I'm gonna call myself. Joe Mama. Is your name Joe Mama? <laughs> they have it on the fucking Smash Bros fucking brawl thing. Joe Mama. <laughs> Yo Mama. <laughs> like a really bit crunch, Patrick Brody. Now that's what I come for. That's the quality content I come for. Yo mama jokes in the first. Oh my god, why are they so big? I guess we're not children, right? They're like teenagers. So I guess it makes a bit more sense that they're fucking huge. It just seems a little weird that they're so giant. Are we going to be like kaiju in this world? What was my Susie voice again? Oh yeah. Ugh. What the hell? Chris? Boom? Is that you? Are we like back in the past? God damn it, Chris, where the hell are we? Whatever. Let's just try and find a way out of here. Well, obviously, Susie, and I said Chris, obviously, Susie, we're in the goddamn underground, you know? We fell through the door. There was that door in our main town. Which makes me wonder if we'll actually end up going to Undertale World in, like, the real Deltarune game, right? Also, gotta love this run animation. This is not in real Deltarune, I'm pretty sure. This is a clean-ass run animation. The people who made this game... Kudos! You guys put in a lot of effort. Not Toby Fox. Let's go back. Howdy! I'm Flowey. Flowey the fuckface. Mm, you're new to the underground, aren't you? I got a little song for you. You're gonna love it. Welcome to the under... <laughs> Snap his little neck. Golly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I hope Susie just fucking eats him. This is the one time I hope we get edgy Susie. Someone ought to teach him how to mind his own damn business. Susie, thank you. I really appreciate you right now. Hey, that's no way to talk to a kind-hearted stranger. So what? I'm still a rock star. Leave us alone and get out of the way. But, don't you want to know about your soul? About love? <laughs> you want to know about love? You love the Noel, whatever the fuck her name is. You love that Animal Crossing looking motherfucker, don't you? Dude. Why do you want to show us this stuff so badly? Do you want our souls or something? 
I'm just desperate for a friend. <laughs> How'd you? I didn't know. You're the one who said it. Oh my god, Susie, goddamn hitting us with the Dr. Eggman Chaos Emerald trick. You thought you could trick me with that fake emerald, didn't you? So, how did you know it wasn't the real one? Tails! <laughs> because you just told me, Fox Boy. You fool! I have 70 alternate accounts! Chris, let's teach this idiot a lesson. Oh my god, are we gonna have to... <gasps> the hell are you doing? You got dildos? What are those weapons? <laughs> We're in a battle? How do you not know this? No one's gonna know what you're doing if you find out this, idiot. <laughs> this is so different. What the fuck? There's no box. How do I fight you? Fine. If it'll get you to shut up, then hurry up and show us how you do it. Don't worry, this won't take long at all. <laughs> Why does Susie look so fucking weird? See that heart? That's your soul. The very culmination of your being. So are you gonna alternate between styles? Is it gonna be like a back and forth of fighting? I'll be real. I much prefer the Deltarune style of fighting. That's just me. I know a lot of people love the Undertale style and it's iconic and I get it. But it's kind of lame. <laughs> You're stuck to between like a tiny little box. Betwixt the butt cheeks of the, the, the white side and the other white side. It's not great, right? Whereas the Deltarune style you have the tension points. It's a lot more of a refined system. Delta Rune isn't perfect, but I think it does battling a lot better. Your soul starts off weak, but what the hell am I on your side? <laughs> Look at me flipping you off with all four of my fingers. You've only got three. Because you're a monster. Wow. What the fuck, Flowey? So rude. The human has to fight the monsters, and like hell I'm gonna fight with you. Oh my god, okay, this is weird. And we have tension points still, so it's literally just Delta Rune, but mixed with Undertale's fighting combat. Now get out of here! <gasps> I'm confused. I'm really confused. <laughs> huh, we showed that flower was boss. It was kind of weird how he tried to trick us and steal our souls. Whatever the hell that means. I don't got a soul. Also, I thought magic only worked in the dark world. I mean, this world looks pretty dark. Oh no. Hello? Is everything okay and... Isn't that... Yo, mama! <laughs> what the hell is she doing here? Ah. Uh, please excuse me. I'm not canon. <laughs> uh, hey, wait a sec! What the hell was that all about? You think she'd be happier to see us? We should probably try and catch up with her, huh? What the fuck? <laughs> what does that even mean? In ruins. I'm in ruins. Despite being in an entirely new world, you can still see the light. You are filled with determination. Hell yeah, we are. <laughs> Wait, don't you want to see? Why the hell is she running away? I don't know. Let me lock the door. Don't come through, Susie. This is my mama. Joe mama. Are the spikes? Oh, this is going to be dead easy. We can just run through. Chris like a training dummy. We should beat it up. It looks pretty strong. Do it, 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 do it. I don't want to beat it up. That's fair. Oh, we get to encounter through both, but his name isn't yellow. Then I guess we act? Talk. Talk? Ultimate heal? Rude buster? Okay, so this is like end of chapter two, Chris and Susie. Because Susie has heal. Oh, we can spare now. So, yeah, but this is just like optimized Deltarune Undertale combination combat. Interesting. It's time for me to bend down and pray to Christ. <laughs> um, hey, Miss uh, Dreamer. We're kind of wondering why you're running away from us. May God have mercy on your soul. <laughs> My apologies. I could not bear these emotions. And I did not want to worry you too. But of course, I failed at that. I really am. Show mama. Oh, uh. I'm sorry. Please do not apologize. You did nothing wrong. 
I'm the one who made the joke. <laughs> but I must ask you. My child, who had been taken from us far too early. The fuck? <gasps> she thinks that we're, uh, Chara. We even have the same color palette. My child, who in spite of your light-hearted pranks, was a delight to our people down here. My child, is it truly you? <laughs> and if it is, let me tell you this joke. Joe Mama so horny, she fell in love with a pile of bones. <laughs> That's not a joke. <laughs> <clears throat> what taken? Ma'am, I'm pretty sure Chris is too weeny to get themselves killed. Chris? Who the fuck that? Uh, yeah? Your kid is Chris, right? No. <laughs> of course, I apologize for my emotional outburst. Even if they survived, they would not have even lived this long. It was unreasonable for me to have thought that Chris was them. It's whatever. I'm gonna give you a hug anyway. I don't know who the fuck you are. So you say that I am the mother of this child? I don't remember birthing you. <laughs> you didn't come from this pussy. <laughs> um, yeah. You know my last name as well. Yeah? You taught little kids at the school? Really? And when was this shit? Well, unfortunately, I am not the same Toriel. Huh? I am not a teacher. Nor am I the caretaker of Chris. Rather, I'm the caretaker of the ruins. And formerly, a fairly regarded royal figure. <laughs> you remember the fairly from that. So how could this... Not that... Huh? Could it be that you two are from another world? Da da da! Yeah, no shit, dude. I guess that explains what's going on. Do I have to get out of here? Possibly. I was once told a yo mama joke that your mama is so fat that she lives in two different postal codes. Now imagine that your mama was so fat that she had to click like on this button to help lose some weight. <laughs> Something you guys should consider. But if your mama was even fatter than that, let's say big enough to be in two dimensions at once, maybe that would open up a rift that you two were able to travel through to get to this world. You could perhaps meet with the underground's royal scientist. Anything but, please. He is always doing interesting experiments. He? He may be able to help you travel hope. Gasta? And how do we find this guy? <gasps> yes, because this must be a prequel. This takes place before Undertale. Otherwise, it would make no sense for it to be saying this, right? You would have to travel all the way around to Heartland. It is pretty far away, but I'm sure that you can make it. After all, you both are traveling together, are you not? Hell yeah, we are! Excellent! That'd be really weird if you weren't traveling together. <laughs> I will prepare something for you to take on your travels. It should not take very long to reach the end of these ruins. Good luck, you two. Uh, thanks? Oh, Chris. You two could possibly use my help on the way? I will give you a cell phone. You already have one? Oh fuck, you already have my number? <laughs> then I can give you my phone number. Awesome, now I have two moms in my phone. Which one is which? Otherworldly mom, okay, <laughs> I was gonna say. If you have a need for anything, just call. I hope to see you two very soon. And hopefully you don't die to these bitch made enemies. <laughs> So we gotta meet with a royal scientist to get you home. Hmm. This should be pretty fun. Let's get going, Chris. Hell yeah. I wanna meet Gasta. I got a rematch in line. That motherfucker did me dirty last time. Don't think I forgot about you, Gasta. Hello, Froggy. Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act, yeah, dude, I've played Undertale before, haven't we all? Wait, what? The next thing that's about to get forward is your face. Oh. Wow. There was some quirky dialogue. Unfortunately, it's gone. Didn't need it anyway. Sorry, Susie. It says take one. Chris, 
We should just take all of it. That's my girl. Take one each. Can I take more? Whatever, at least I get something. No, I wanted to take all of it. Whatever, dude. Whatever. This is the good, goody goody two shoes run, right? It makes sense. Oh my god, there's enemies. Please leave me alone. Oh no. <laughs> so those cracks on the ground will make us fall? Uh, got it. Susie is now immune to cracks. <laughs> if only I could be immune to cracks. That booty in my face all the time. Hello, this is Toriel. I suppose you were already aware of my affinity for pie, yes? Well, I would like to know your flavor preferences. Tell me what's your flavor. Chris, do you prefer cinnamon or butterscotch? Uh, cinnamon. Cinnamon, I see. And Susie, what would you prefer? Me? Boom. I guess butterscotch. I see. A contrarian. <laughs> cinnamon and butterscotch, thank you very much. I see where this is going. Oh, Froggy! Oh, how am I supposed to remember this, dude? It's been so long. I think it's here. Nice. Okay, it's not. It's down. Oh, yeah, I remember. It's been a little while. Can't really avoid this one. Shit. Oh, we can already spare something, though. <laughs> oh, we can already kill. We can compliment while it's asleep. Too easy! Apparently, complimenting people in their sleep is how you win! Bye, Froggy. Who said you could push me around? I did. Move to the button. Now, why would I move if you're being so darn rude? Because if you don't, I'll make you move by force. I'll crush you, break you into tiny little rocks. Then you will make a little tiny rock family. And that tiny rock family will become my new army that I will move on to the button. Thank you. I am moving, prissy missy. Well, I warned you. <laughs> oh my god! Move, damn it! That's so cool! Nice squash and stretch. Nice. So proud of you, Susie. Hello, Boogly Goo. What's your name again? Gasta Blaster? Sleepy Sleepy? Uh, hello? Oh, was I not convincing? Aren't you a cop? I would never. Oh, am I in the way? Of letting you do crime? <laughs> Spider Donuts? Leave seven gold in the web? You think I have seven gold? Why are the spiders selling stuff anyway? And why is it so damn expensive? Let's get out of here, Susie. We don't need these freaks. Sorry, sorry, I just remembered there's gonna be a boss later on where I have to fight you guys. Did not call you freaks. Didn't mean it. Please do not report back. I swear to God, if you fucking report back, I will murder every single one of your kind. In a nice way. Hello, this is Toriel. Apologies for not responding to your call. I don't care about you. Sorry, there's a spot. There's a thing. There's a doodad. I want to have a look at what it is. Oh, it's just... Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, Toriel. Fuck. It's been a while. It's been a while. Since I played on a tail. Honestly, it's kind of nice that we're, fight we're doing this, right? Because uh, this is so faithful to the original. Uh... And it's been so long since we played the actual original Undertale that it genuinely does feel like... Oh my god, did you see that gremlin run at me? It really does feel like a nice uh, callback, you know, to the original. In the most faithful way... Son of a bitch, I pressed the X button. In the most faithful way, while also being Deltarune, you know? Get out of my sight. Banana. Orange. That was nearly the end of the run. I just want you to know. We were literally seconds from death. And yet we're fine. Simply because I am built different to dodging fruits. Except for that one! Do, 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 do. Is the knife here? <laughs> <laughs> what? Rossi smoking a doobie! <laughs> a big fat blunt! I'm taking the knife with me anyway. It's a pleasant plastic toy knife. Yeah, you know we're taking it. Oh shoot, Chris, <laughs> a knife! You should totally equip that. Those are your style. Huh, me? Uh, I kinda like my big pencil. I'm only gonna give this up if there's like a big ass stick. Yeah, you're not getting either. 
You know, this is a pacifist run. You're gonna be good for this run, Susie. Unlike <laughs> Doopy. <laughs> Unlike Rolsey, who's being anything but good. Toked out. Doopy. Rolsey, why are you smoking weed? Just come with us. We start to touch Rolsey, but suddenly. The Doobie's gone! They didn't even get a hit of that bliff. That bliff? That spliff. Wow, man. I'm not a weed smoker. <laughs> I'm not hip with the kids. Who do you think I am? Ganja man! Whatever. If this magic truly did work, then I would be king of the pirates. Um. Hi, Miss Streamer. Oh, hello, Chris. And other. <laughs> It is wonderful that you were able to make it here unharmed, but I would not say unharmed. We did die once, shamefully. And then got high. <laughs> and then I got high. Uh, no? My home is just up ahead. Please follow me inside. I have a surprise for you. <gasps> but it's got bullshit pie? Welcome home, you two. Whoa. This is way bigger than Chris's house. What the fuck? What an upgrade. The surprise was at the end of the hallway to the right. I will meet you two there. <laughs> it's a knife! Don't worry, we already brought a knife, Toriel. I know the real surprise is in here. At least it should be. What the fuck? Where's the cinnamon pie? Surprise! It's a storage container! I have assembled a room for you two. It's still quite unorganized, but we can always do that later. But... We aren't staying here. We're trying to leave. Leave? What's that? <laughs> oh yes, that is correct. Perhaps you might want to rest here before you go then? I could turn this into a guest room later. That sounds good. Excellent. I have a pie in the oven right now. The baby's coming. <laughs> Feel free to take a nap while it cooks. Oh sweet. Rest well, Chris and Susie. That really is your real name? <laughs> she really isn't that different, huh? Now I'm kind of wondering what it's like in this world. I want to stay here. After all, my whole fucking persona is escapism. <laughs> That's the whole thing, you know? That's the whole Delta room. Might as well rest up while we can. We got a long road ahead of us. Guess we might as well. Let's climb in and hope we don't go super duper sickle mode in the night. The fuck? What is this? William Afton? Chris? You are quite lost, aren't you? Well, you can say that again. I'm on the Amori Road, what the fuck? I have a pre 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 Whatever the fuck that mystic bullshit means. <laughs> Defeat the one that carries your own essence. Chara? Meet with me. I can set you free. Why would I want to be free? I shall see you soon. But I don't want to be free. Leave me in luxury. Chris. Wake up! Chris! You've been sleeping for two hours! The boy apparently got cold. It gives less HP, but I ate most of it. But I did leave a slice for you. You got the butterscotch pie. Awesome. That's not what I asked for. I asked for cinnamon, but okay. Do 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 Running through the hallway, running through the... Wait a moment. You weren't really gonna leave without saying bye, were you? <laughs> I forgot to warn you of the monsters that live there. I mean, you should already be familiar with them, considering the fact that you've already fought monsters down here. <laughs> what? I can only assume that y in your world, humans and monsters live in peace. That is not so in this world. Whereas monsters have been banished to the underground. We made songs about it. <laughs> Where the tyrannous Asgore has sworn to take any human soul. If you change your minds on your journey, please be him over the head with my skull. <laughs> if we change our minds, then. Never mind. 
I wish you the best of luck. I know you're not going to stay here. Be good, won't you? My child. If you really are my child. <laughs> Chris, that was really weird. Do you think she was about to ask us to stay? Dumb motherfucker, I don't want to stay. <laughs> well, we shouldn't let her down if she gave us up like that. Let's go home. Actually home, not here home. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, let's go back. Yeah, you're right. No. Shut up, Susie. We're going real home. We're taking the polar back. We're doing the... You know? Oh my god, no! What the fuck? Back off! Oh, I've got super duper mode. Look at my long ass giraffe neck. <laughs> and let you leave? Run away to your other world? Back to the comfort of your loving mommy? My loving mommy too. <laughs> we ain't sharing, motherfucker. Boy, just hearing there's even more worlds out there. Imagine the fun I'd have. <laughs> what a goofy ass face. What's that supposed to be? Shut up. Just get the hell away from us. Or what? You would kill me? You wouldn't kill your best friend, would you, Chris? You wouldn't let him get away from you, would you, Chris? Alright, you've gone too damn far. My favorite word to say. It's back once again. That's how you know we're playing a Deltarune game. They use damn. You're gonna eat those words, plant. Aw, oh, little on me. That's just silly. Why would I do that? When I can have your souls instead. Oh. Damn. Oh my god! This is sick. We're already fighting Super Flowey. But this isn't Photoshop Flowey. This is just regular Flowey. Red Buster. So we can't spare? I can spare. Defend. You spared the enemy but didn't have a yellow name. You're trying to spare me? <laughs> That's rich. This world is kill or be killed. I will never accept your mercy. Oh, we know you will, Flowey. We've seen it happen in real time. It'll happen again. And again! Flowey cackles to himself. Oh yeah? Then we try again. Do you honestly think I'll let you go like that? I'm not her. I'm him! <laughs> You're a real idiot if you think I'm sparing you. Well, you are though, Flowey. You are sparing us. That's just the nature of it, you know? That's just who you are. You can think you're super cool, super sly. Is this a joke? Are your brain dead? I'm never gonna accept your mercy. Now shut up and die. I didn't say anything though. See, that's the problem with you, Flowey. Too presumptuous. Whoo! Who doggy? We'll keep sparing you. It's free heals. Free munch. Yikes. We are taking a little bit of damage. But I like our odds. Listen, I've been training. And that's how Yellow's been training me up for this moment, you know. I can take on someone like you, Flowey. Fuck! Fuck! Are we taking damage with that? Yeah, we did there. Okay. Spare. Show us what you're made of. Give us that ultimate heal, Susie. 4 HP. Are you serious? That cost all my... Okay. It's fine. Didn't expect anything much, really, from Susie anyway. It's fine. We are close to death. Come on, we can hold on. We must be close. This is a damn tutorial fight. They wouldn't go that hard, would they? Fuck, man. Yikes, that's tough. That's really tough. So by the looks of it, we have to do the damage thing no matter what. That's a little bit sad. I guess it's a replica of the actual flowery fight. And it makes a lot of sense, you know? But I was hoping that we could spare our boy. Flowey is not our boy. Why did I just say that? Sorry, Flowey. I'm really not sorry, though, am I? Wow, that's like some Undertale Yellow shit, dude. Well, now that we know that we have to fight, you can goddamn bet this is going to get absolutely flames. Beautiful. 
Well, we know what we're doing now. Rude Buster. Holy fuck, 62 damage. Not too bad. Dude, this fight's going to be so goddamn easy with the information that we have now. We have all of the download for the fight. And I'm still sucking ass. Nice. Your ass does not deal any damage, Chris. Fuck! Bro. Nice. Go for it. Go for a Hail Mary. Why not? 62. Dude, we're doing not enough damage, bro. This guy's formidable. <laughs> Why did I say that? Formidable opponent. Fuck, man. I guess if you fight Flowey uh, on the genocide run, because there's got to be a genocide run to this, right? If you fight Flowey on the genocide run, at least you have the levels and power to be able to deal with him. Whereas we have nothing, right? Our asses are cooked. Now, I better not leave this office. Fuck! A few moments later. I forgot that we got the knife. We should probably equip the friggin' knife. No wonder Chris is doing no damage. Am I? Should I be using the instructability that uh, Chris has, right? Chris can instruct. Would it be a better idea for me to use Red Buster instead of Rude Buster? Probably. I think I've been goofing up there. That's kind of Delta Rune's whole thing, right? Let's get some extra bonus points, shall we? That should be enough. This should be good! There you go, that's what we were supposed to be doing. Wow, now I feel like a real dumbass, huh? <laughs> Could've been doing that a lot sooner. Oh, fuck! That would've made this fight a lot easier. Considering I'm nearly dead. <laughs> okay, nice. It's time! Red Buster! Eat my ass, Flowey. Uh-oh. I see an opening. Come on! We can do this! Boom shakalaga! That's some real malicious damage. Is this the only attack that you know? Dick. It's fine. Chris can end this. No! That's not enough. Oh, wait, hold on. Maybe though? Or maybe for really though? And for truly? Maybe Chris can really end this. Come on, Chris. Not enough. Wait, but in another world where Chris is the protagonist, we call it Delta Rune. <laughs> well then, Chris, you clearly not the pushover I thought you were. Talk about fucking clutch, eh? I see that 3 HP down there. <laughs> you can't lie to me. I wouldn't have gone down that easy if I fought anyone else. But you're different. Why, well, through sheer will and determination, wink, wink, nudge, nudge, k k woo. <laughs> you were able to wither me down. So, Chris, it's time to make your final move. Do it. Finish me off. You know, <laughs> you know you want it. What? What? You seriously trying this? This bullshit? Sparing me? You can't possibly be serious. How many times did you die before? <laughs> Come on, Chris. Kill me already. No. I'll spare you. Kill me. Come on. You ain't gonna do this to me, are you? Kill me! Bruh. I will accidentally kill you if you keep doing this. Kill me! Come on, buddy. <laughs> you know why? When I overheard everything, that in another world, she had children. I figured it all out. Figured what out? That maybe if I took your soul, I could explore other worlds in your place. I could see them again. You look so much like them, you know? <laughs> You're a human? You got brown hair. That's about it. <laughs> That's how I figured your brother. Is you. Oh, no! Come on, dude! Must have been as much of a weakling as you. <laughs> Come on, Sans. Save me, Sans. Please save me, Sans. 
Well, that's gonna work on me a second time, idiot. Whatever. It'll be a matter of time before that soul is mine. This isn't the last you've seen of me. Well, thank God Susie came clutch. With that ultimate heal. Damn, Susie. Thank you. I guess that settles it for now. I'm kind of wondering what the deal with that flower was. Finish me off? <laughs> what is he? You kind of sus? <laughs> it's kind of extreme, don't you think, Chris? Well, we might as well get the hell out of here. You god damn right, Susie. Let's freaking get out of here. Out into the wilderness. I'm getting stuffy in here. Delta Traveler. That's the end? What? I didn't read the writing as well. Sorry, I should have read this. But thank you, Sarah. Oh, no, this isn't the end. That was just chapter one. Hey, Chris. There's a person on the ground over there. Is it just me? Or does that look like... Noel! What the hell? What the hell are you doing here? What the hell is Noel doing here? Well... <laughs> you really gonna hit me with that, huh? What? 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 Where am I? Susie? Chris? What on earth is happening? Hey, chill out for a sec. Uh, okay. I guess. I mean, I just got here and I'm already scared. Okay, so this will sound really weird, but we're in a different world. Again! Huh. Wait, am I dreaming again? Huh. No. Everything is still real and boring. But apparently, we need to find some scientist guy to get home. We need to go, like, someplace called Heartland. And also, don't think about the fact that I knew that you were dreaming before. <laughs> okay. It sounds weird, but that's just what we need to do. And also, Rosé is high as fuck. <laughs> Are you coming with me or not? Badunka dunka. I'll come. <laughs> Sweet. That's what I wanted to hear today. Thanks, Noel. Let's go, Chris. Boom shaggy lackey. You goddamn bet we'll go. Look, our team expanded. Rosé has been replaced. Probably for the better. I like Noel a little better than Rosé. Wait, guys, hold on. A branch. Holy shit, it's a really cool stick. <laughs> Screw this pencil. Okay. You were looking for that. You know what? I'm happy for you, Susie. Susie, you're really excited about that tree branch. What are you, five? I mean, you know, it isn't a pencil. <laughs> yeah, okay, Susie. Fuck it, I guess. Oh, here we go. Everyone's favorite interaction. Take another step forward and your head is gone. Is that any way to greet a friend? Whoa, sorry. Didn't mean to scare you. <laughs> I just had my silhouette mode turned on. Great, it's this guy. Yeah, the woods are pretty dark. Speaking of dark, how are you doing? Aren't you the guy that runs a convenience store? Maybe, in another timeline. <laughs> I don't run a convenience store. My brother runs a convenience store. <laughs> I'm Sans. Sans the Skeleton. Aren't you that hoof girl from back in town? Oh my god. <laughs> crazy, crazy. What are you doing out here? What do you mean by that? Are you from our world or something? Huh. Who knows at this point? That tells me everything I need to know. The hell does that mean? I mean, seeing someone from town pawling around with a human? Pawling around with a human, sorry. And then the same someone not recognizing me? It's a bit strange to say the least. Wait, you're not saying what I think I'm saying. I am so confused. Uh, let's not think about that right now. Let's be honest, I'm kind of like a multi-transdimensional being. Could be the sands from your world. I could just be a little goofball. I could be Ness. <laughs> I could be Mad Pat. You're trying to make your way home, right? Yeah, we're trying to find a scientist dude in Hotland. Scientist in Hotland? Sounds like my bro, Odie Chan. The only person that fits that description is Alfie's. She might be able to help. Though, the person before was referred to as a he. The hell does he mean, Alfie's? And how do we get there? You're gonna have to go through the forest. The one you're going through right now! How convenient! Then go through the marsh until you reach a laboratory. That's where you'll be able to meet Alfie's. 
Sounds pretty easy. Not so fast, kid. It'd be a crime. <laughs> you got my brother to worry about, and he's big news. You've never met him before. Is he dangerous? Oh, malicious. <laughs> nah, but he might try to capture that human. He's currently setting up. He's currently out setting up puzzles. You might run into him on the way. So if you encounter him, just play along. Okay. All right. See you up ahead. That was really stupid. I con contraire. On contrast, Susie. Alfie's is the royal scientist. Is there another me in this world? I guess. <laughs> no, there is not. Does that mean there's also... Two Susies? <laughs> Never mind, let's go. Huh? You wish, Noel. You goddamn wish. With your Dr. Slump run. Well, here we are! with one of the great doors! Hey, what the hell is that? One of the doors we need to open down the Amori Road. It's a great door. Who the hell put a door out here? A Monster's Inc. door! <laughs> it opened on its own? Maybe it's a prank. I wouldn't put it past that Sans guy. Neither would I, honestly. No, well, don't fall in. You're gonna die. It's completely dark in here. Hello? Huh? Noel? I'm... Losing balance, you fucking moron. I told you. Noel! Oh, here we go. So this is how we warp through portals, maybe? To different realms? Oh, we're going to the dark world. Are we? With high roll, say? Ugh. What the hell? Wait a minute. Is this the Earthbound font? Are you serious? I am so happy right now. This is might be my favorite Undertale fan game ever. No way are we in Earthbound. So for those of you who've never played Earthbound, this is actually directly just straight up the cave. That is Ness. Ness is Sans. <laughs> Here we are. Map I got it all wrong. Clearly, Sans is Ness is Chris is My head explodes. That great door. It led us to another world? I guess so. Wait a minute. This is so derivative. <laughs> Where's the door? Well, we did fall for a while. I guess you're right. Hey, does anyone else feel weird? Like, there's something about this place that feels really off? Now that you mention it, I do feel a bit strange, but it feels cooler. What about you, Chris? My ring is glowing? What the heck? It is glowing! Chris! What's with that aura glowing from you? Wait, are we able to cast magic here? Chris, let's try casting something that makes us feel less weird. <laughs> PK Thunder! Your soul shined its power into Noel. Noel shined her light into your soul. What the hell? Light clear. Oh, dude, I kind of missed that, man. What just happened? Everything went all white. But I don't feel weird anymore. Me neither. Chris, I think the spell worked. But how the hell do we go back to the forest? Maybe we find another grey door? Might as well. Not like we really get anywhere just standing in this cave. Come on, let's go. Oh, mother. And we're going to check this out next time. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I'm goddamn so stoked for this series. I didn't realize it's going to take us to Earthbound. One of my favorite fucking RPGs of all time. This is sick. Genuinely in love with this game already. You've hit right at the core. So excited for this. I hope we get to see some Earthbound enemies. Maybe even Ness himself. Dr. Sadden, count me in. This is going to be a real fun romp, I can tell. If, I swear to God, if we see MatPat, if we see some Ness's Sans shit in this game, I'm going to laugh. I'm going to be so stoked. It's going to tickle my funny bone. If you guys enjoyed this and you want to see more, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Catch y'all next time.